we are gonna be painting my BMW E30 with the Rust-Oleum Turbo Spray Paint Can. Now these things are comically huge. They're, they're ridiculous. Let me give you a little comparison to a regular spray paint bottle. Now these things are supposed to be really good for painting cars that you can do a car in just a couple passes. This was about $12 at Home Depot, and these are known for having a really nice fan that covers a lot of area in a very short amount of time. If this fender comes out good, this is gonna be a test fender. I'm gonna do the entire car with this. I have already prepped the fender. We have some masking, uh, some all these bags, as you guys can see. Uh, this is a flat black replacement fender that was placed on the car. So we're gonna paint this and see just how well the turbo can holds up and if it's it's worth the hype. Wow. Holy smokes. Jeez. Wow. That was literally like two and a half passes. We're gonna let this first coat dry up, get a little bit tacky, and then we're gonna put on our second coat. We don't want any runs or anything like that, but. We don't have any runs, anything like that. There are a couple spots that I have neglected personally that I'm gonna have to hit more on this next coat, but it's looking really good. Nice little tackiness, not leaving any impressions in the paint. So that's how you know that it is ready for another coat. All right, so we are just about to throw down the fourth coat. Everything is looking so good. So, so, so good. But I think this is gonna be our last coat and then we're gonna see just how it came out. We're gonna use my good camera. We are on the GoPro right now because I didn't wanna get overspray on my very expensive camera. Uh, so let's hit it with another coat. So it's been a couple days and the paint has dried up really nicely and guys, it looks so, so good. Let me show you the final results. Now we do have a little bit of orange peel on the paint. That's from the paint underneath the top layer drying uh, at a different speed than the top layer drying. So it does have a little bit of that orange peel, which is just a grainy look uh, in the paint in the right light. This looks so much better than the house paint that somebody else decided to paint this car with. I would definitely recommend picking up a can and made for super fast, easy work. Normally with other spray paint cans, you can get areas where you, you paint more, you paint less, you get a lot of streaking, but with this, with such a wide fan, really made it easy. Anyways guys, thanks for watching. If you'd like to give it a thumbs up, if you wanna see more content in the future, click the subscribe button. Drop me a comment, let me know what you thought. We'll see you guys in the next one real, real soon. Peace.